हेलो गाइस कैसे आप सभी लोग वेलकम बैक टू अनदर वीडियो तो गाइस जैसा कि आप सभी लोगों को याद होगा कि लास्ट वाली वीडियो में हमने द डेवलपमेंट ऑफ मेडिकल साइंस के बारे में जाना था और आज वाली वीडियो में हम द बर्थ ऑफ यूनाइटेड नेशंस के बारे में जानेंगे तो चलिए शुरू करते हैं द बर्थ ऑफ यूनाइटेड नेशन फॉर्मेशन ऑफ द लीग ऑफ नेशन द इंडस्ट्रियल रेवल्यूशन स्टार्ट इन इंग्लैंड एंड सून स्प्रेड टू अदर नेशन लाइक जर्मनी फ्रांस एंड पोर्टुगल दीज इंडस्ट्रियलाइज कंट्रीज नीडेड टू थिंग्स नेमली द रॉ मटीरियल फॉर मैनुफैक्चरिंग एंड द न्यू मार्केट टू सेल द गुड्स मैनुफैक्चर्ड बाई दैम दे गॉट बोथ दियर पर्पज सॉल्ट इन द नॉन इंडस्ट्रियलाइज एशियन एंड एफ्रीकन कंट्रीज सून दे स्टार्टेड कॉलोनाइजिंग दीज कंट्रीज टू मेक दैम सेल्स वेल्दी एज अ रिजल्ट दे बिकेम जेलस ऑफ ईच अदर एंड वॉन्टेड द ओन एम्पायर टू फ्लरिश they started fighting among themselves which finally led to a great war this war was called the world war 1 it broke out in 1914 and lasted till 1918 birth of the united nations the league failed but the idea of the league did not die in 1941 us president franklin d roosevelt and british prime minister winston churchill signed the atlantic charter between they pledged to work towards a more effective system to maintain peace in the world and promote cooperation in 1942 the representatives of the allies the world war 2 coalition of 26 countries fighting against italy germany and japan signed a declaration in this declaration they accepted the principles of the atlantic charter after a year four of the allies the united states the united kingdom the soviet union and china agreed to establish a general international organization they called the organization the united nation objectives of the union the objectives of the union united nations are as set forth in charter are the following to maintain international peace and security based on respect for the principle of equal human rights and self determination of peoples to develop friendly relations among nations to cooperate in solving international problems of an economic social cultural or humanitarian charter to be a center for harmonizing the actions of nations in achieving these ends to protect environment and to justify use of natural resources principles of the un There was a number of principles set in the charter of the UN. All the member countries must agree with these principles which would help the UN to achieve its goal. The United Nations act in accordance with the following principles. All member states are sovereign and equal. All are pledged to fulfill their obligations under the charter in good faith. All are pledged to settle their international disputes by peaceful means and without endangering international peace security and justice they are to refrain in their international relations from the threat or use of force against any other states they are to give the un every assistance in an action it takes in accordance with the charter the united nations shall not intervene in matters which are essential to the wants of any state except when it is acting to inform international peace today 193 countries are members of un extra points the flag of the un has a world map surrounded by olive branches with a light blue background olive branches symbolize peace how russia has the veto power instead of the soviet union thank you aaj ki is wali video mein itna hi milte hain agli video mein goodbye